include the text from do not till never overestimate your own ability and here we go done with this right uh, it was supposed to have again spacing remember and backspace to get rid of the eight number the eight number bullet insert a table with five columns and two rows after the text here are some courses we have on offer i'll find it again i'll click in the beginning so that i can find it again find this for me find next there we go here are some courses find let's see why click again and insert it here we go find what this main document did I get it next Okay, if we can't find it, maybe probably there's a problem with case sensitiveness, or here are some courses. I'll try once more, otherwise, I have to find manually. Here we go, find next. Ah, I got it. Here are some courses that we have on offer. After this, I'm going to a table which has five columns and five rows. There we go. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Here we have it. Now what I can see is I have this black background which is not looking nice. Uh, I can I would rather convert it into although the examiner doesn't say so, but it should look like this. So what I'll do is I'll simply convert into white background. First I convert the boundaries into the grid line should be black and I'll convert the background using this to white again. Ah, here we go. I have it. Now what I have to do is I have to enter the following data. Here we go. Ah, just keep on entering. I'll simply copy paste. I've got the privilege since I have the PDF file. Well, you students, you have to enter all this manually. You have to key in the data. So remember, you won't get the privilege. To do this in your examination so be sure you know how to key in data properly don't make any mistakes case sensitive is really important typing wrong data can actually lead to wrong filtering of data searching of data and might definitely create lots of problems for you afterwards so be sure that you enter the right data okay I have the level oops looks like copy the wrong thing beginner intermediate copy again intermediate I have the advanced One hour, one day, and three hours, one hour, one day, three hours. Oops, taking a lot of time, but definitely we have to do it. This is what is required. This is how actually you learn how to create professional documents. And this is what is required by your IGCSC ICP. Here the group. I have the maximum four, and I have one to one. Go. Done. Make sure the table fits within the column. Using text trap where needed, make sure the text is aligned to the top of the cell if text is wrapped. So here I go. I'll go to table properties, and I'll make sure. He says, here we go, positioning, okay, side, I will 
see to the top margins there we go right okay done that now all you have to do is uh, right click auto fit the window to make sure it fits with the window format only text top row rows of the table to be centered and underlined top rows of the table to be centered and underlined format only the text in the top rows of the table to be centered and underlined here we go so top row is a top row should be center and underlined done format only the text of the top row of the table to be underlined apply light gray shading 20 to 40 percent the top row of the table so i'll repeat the step again i will simply come here bordering shading shading i will simply fill black color since your gray comes in between white and black in between this so i'll choose in black and going from white to black i'll have this so i'll choose 30 percent since the examiner says between 20 and 40 i'll use 30 percent and here we go oops i think so i stepped to the wrong one let's check again Go, hold on, hold on. Let's check once more. Origin shading. Oops. I'll just make it white and I'll make it black and 30% gray. Okay, ah, that's fine. It looks 30%. Uh, merge the top row of the cell so the text is centered across the five columns. You select all this and you simply merge the cells. Right. Set all grid lines to be visible with line 2 to 2.5 width. Right click, table properties, orange shading, borders between 2 and 2.5. I'll make it much okay okay done right so I've done this part okay place the image this at the beginning of the paragraph that starts our extreme sports so again we have to find for our experience Sports gives you from the start of the document find here we go place the image and then surf.gif at the beginning of the paragraph that starts our extreme sports gives you align the image with the top so insert picture have to go to the particular location where the files are stored there we go done let's see next align the image with the top line of the paragraph and the left margin make sure the text wraps to the right and below of the image so we'll go mapping right resize the image three centimeter high and maintain aspect ratio so i'll make it three simply select this and i'll make it three press enter go i got three you can see over here six x three resize this it may look like this fine it is actually looking like this ah just got a problem right Save the document. You are now going to prepare some reports for the company. The next part of our tutorial will be using a suitable database package to basically import this file using Access, where we'll work with queries, reports, export the data into text again, and we'll come back to this word processing document once again. I'll save this file and 
Bye for now. Thank you.